name is Shani Cole and welcome to my channel Handbags and Happiness. If you like videos about handbags, shopping vlogs, or anything girly, pretty, um, just things that make you happy, please subscribe to my channel. I would greatly appreciate it. For today's, For today's video, I have a new bag to show you. It was on my wish list. This bag came out in either the end of December, like right after Christmas or early January. Well, let me say this version of this bag because this bag has been out for a long time, but they put out a new version of this bag. And when I saw it, I just fell in love with it, especially in a particular color. So I decided to get it right away. I actually did not purchase it from Tory Burch. I actually purchased it from, I believe, Saks because this bag does not usually go on sale or hasn't gone on sale yet. And Saks was offering um, a great deal. I got $100 off this bag. So when that opportunity popped up, I had to scoop it up. So from the thumbnail, you know this is the new Tory Burch Fleming bag. So I'm so excited to show you this bag, but what I'm also going to tell you about is the changes from the old model of the Fleming bag to the new model that my essay told me about. And I think they made some great changes to this bag and it's definitely one of the reasons why I decided to pick her up. All right, here it is. It comes in the typical Tory Burch linen dust bag with the purple string and emblem. And I'm just gonna open it up. And the bag I got was the Tory Burch new Fleming bag in the color pink magnolia. Oh, she's so pretty. I'm inserting this picture to show you how well this bag came packaged from Saks Fifth Avenue. This is the large size Fleming bag. It comes in two sizes. This is the large or the regular size. It also comes in a small size. This size is priced at $498. I'm not going to give you the dimensions, I'm going to insert them because I always forget to give them or I give them the wrong. <laughs> so I'm going to insert the dimensions here on the side and you can, so you can have the accurate dimensions for the bag and the chain. So this beautiful bag comes in several colors. It comes in this pink magnolia color. It comes in a gray color called overcast. It comes in black and it comes in new cream which is like an ivory tone. The smaller version comes in a green color which they call spinach. So give me one second, I'm gonna take out all the paper and the stuffing and then I'm gonna get into the bag. Hi, <laughs> I tilted the camera down so you can get a better look at this bag as I go through it. So here she is in the Magnolia Pink color and the previous swimming was made in lambskin and I think this is lambskin as well but it's definitely a more structured bag so I don't think the lambskin is as delicate they call this a smooth leather with the diamond quilting pattern, which the diamond quilting is really gorgeous. It's very puffy, as you can see. So the first major change I want to talk about is the tassel. The tassel is definitely different. It's more refined. The other one had a piece wrapped around it that created like this dome shape. This is just the leather wrapped around and then sewn together with two pieces. It's definitely more refined. And I think it's going to keep the, I don't know what they call these, like the little things on the tassel you know, really nice and together. So the previous version of the Fleming did not have two shoulder pads. So it, I believe it only had one, but it definitely did not have two. And this one has two, so if you wear it as a shoulder bag or crossbody, you know, you'll have that comfort of having a strap. Now this bag has some gorgeous hardware. This hardware is like a brass age gold um it's not shiny even though it's coming out from the light it's more of a muted uh gold but it's definitely a gold gold oh one thing i forgot to tell you about the tassel is that the tassel is detachable it has like a little clip that's very reminiscent of the louis vuitton um clip and it comes off i i don't have scissors on me but i would show you but it does come off so i just unclipped it from there so if you turn the bag around you see that there is a pocket on the back you have the quilted leather you have the embossed tee but you have this back pocket and everybody knows these days we want a back pocket for our phone that is a magnetic uh, closure here that keeps the, it in place well it's pretty strong because as soon as I pop it open it's drawing it back in and like I said in previous videos I'm very old school I had a this is a Fear Bradley case on my old school 7 plus iPhone and you can see it fits right in there. Now it doesn't close with the phone in there, but the phone does fit and it doesn't 
make it to be too bulky. Look at the bottom. The bottom is smooth leather. Nice piece. Another major difference is the side. So a lot of people complain that there was a pinch sides to the old Fleming. So instead of being puffed out like it is on this bag, it pinched in. And of course that causes you to have less space in the bag. So these are, this is a very structured bag and the sides, these sides are pushed out. So let's open up the bag. So now you have a, instead of the round closure on the old filming bag, you have a square magnetic closure and it says Tory Burch. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. And this thing is pretty strong. Yeah, and it has a piece of sticker on there or something right now, but you can hear it. It just pops right back into place. Okay, so we're gonna open it and look inside the bag. So. The last and probably my favorite feature of this bag that the old bag did not have, the old bag had a fabric interior and this is a 100% leather bag, you guys. So, I got mine for $398. If you can get this bag on sale, or even at the price point of $498, you're getting an all leather bag. So inside you have two compartments right here on the side. This is definitely big enough for some receipts, money, cards, things of that nature. You have one open compartment, and then I'm gonna turn it over to this side, and you have a zip compartment. And the zip compartment is pretty tight, but I will tell you also, the zip compartment of this bag is 100% leather as well. So, a 100% leather bag. I am loving this color. It goes perfectly, obviously, with my sweater I have on that my mom got me for Valentine's Day. Digress. I think this bag is absolutely gorgeous. She is so pretty. I would like to film a what fits in this bag. Um, if that's something that you guys are interested in, please let me know in the comments down below. I haven't done one of those on my channel before, but I know they're very popular here on YouTube. I could do a comparison just to other bags in my collection. I just really love this bag and I think it is a awesome, awesome bag. Here's a picture of the old Fleming bag. You can see the old tassel was not as classy. It only had one large shoulder strap and then the interior was fabric. Also look at the structure loss due to the pinched in sides on that bag. Oh, thank you so much for watching. That's gonna be all. I'm gonna sign out from here. Um, just showing you a beautiful shot of this bag. Wow, she's pretty in pink. Um, I will insert some mod shots at the end. Thank you so much for watching. And until the next video, be safe and be happy. Bye.